This series of videos is about this product. It's called Cold Plus. It is supposed to increase the efficiency of uh, refrigeration and air conditioning equipment. It's, it's a type of oil. I'm not going to get real deep into what it does, but it's supposed to reduce the energy usage of air conditioning and uh, refrigeration equipment. Now, I'm going to do a test on it with a small unit. It's a uh, three-quarter ton mini split that I use to uh, cool my fermenting room. Okay, the reason I'm going to use this equipment to work on is one thing, it's something I have, and it has a very steady temperature for the condensing unit. It runs at 70 degrees pretty much year round. So I will know exactly what the ambient air is going to be. Also, the box that it is cooling, it's cooling down to about 62, 63 degrees. Uh, it's a fermenting room, so it's a very constant load. It's a light load, but it's very constant. I figured this would be the best way to test this stuff, as I have the most control over the ambient temperatures. Okay, so let's take a look at the equipment. Now this... Uh, I have a uh, device placed on here that will show the amperage draw, the voltage, the accumulated kilowatt hours, and the instant kilowatt hours. So I'm going to be using this, and this is only the compressor. This does not include the fan or any of the controls. So I thought it would be best to put this on here. This would give me an idea of how much power the compressor itself is using. Now, I also have a kilowatt device on this thing, and I'll show you that next. This is a kilowatt device, and it is going to be reading the entire uh, power usage of the equipment, including the condenser fan, the evaporator fan, the electronics, and everything. So it's going to record everything on there as I go along with this. This is going to be set up for about a month. I started this, uh, I think, the 6th of June. And this is going to be reading up until about the 6th of July, at which point I'm going to take my readings, and then I'm going to add the uh, Cold Plus in there, and we'll see what happens. To give you an idea of how this is set up, you can see this is actually located inside a building. It's actually in a basement. It's got a very stable temperature throughout the year. The reason I put it here was because I did not want the outside, the varying outside air temperatures to affect the readings. Now you can hear the unit just started up. This unit, uh, oftentimes, it has a fan that uh, is uh, pressure controlled. It usually runs without the fan and uh, actually up to fairly high ambient temperature. So this is always going to run with just the compressor running and then the fan will come on for a few seconds. So that's normal for it to do. Now you can see the fan went on. This is the way this thing works. By it always being the same, then I think I can make a pretty good test here. Now up here, I've got a kilowatt. You, can, you can't see it very well. Uh, and I've showed you this. It's reading the energy usage of the entire unit. That's the indoor fan, the outdoor fan, and the compressor. So all this stuff is in operation right now. It's been going since the 6th of June. And I'm going to be placing this uh, Cold Plus product into this thing and I will have recorded all the information that this thing can give me especially that there we'll see if there's less energy use when I use the cold plus product in there uh, over it running just as it is now one other thing I should note it also has a fairly constant temperature 
in the conditioned space, which is another room in this basement. It's used for fermenting my beer and storing my beer. And so its temperature is fairly stable. It doesn't go up a lot or down a lot. When I put a new jug of uh, beer in there to ferment, it does increase the temperature a little bit and actually puts a little bit of a load on it. The reason I haven't done this earlier in the year, this is summer, it wasn't working. It didn't, you know, it didn't need cooling in there. It's naturally pretty cold anyway. So now that it's summer, I can use it. There is a little bit higher temperature in there, but it should be stable. The whole point of this thing is to try to get stable temperatures. So we'll see how this works out. Next time I'll be uh, putting in the cold plus.